Apigee's API console is the best way to explore the structure of an API. With Apigee to go, you can describe your API to Apigee and get your own API console that you can embed on your API documentation pages. After naming your console and choosing a URL, you tell Apigee how to authenticate with your API. Today, Apigee knows how to speak HTTP basic auth, OAuth 1, either two-legged or three-legged, OAuth 2, and custom token authentication, sometimes called developer keys or app IDs. When you've configured everything, be sure to save your work. Next, you describe your API resources using the Web Application Description Language, or WADL, using standard XML. In brief, you define the base path for the resources that represent your API, and then you describe each individual resource and its methods. Apigee provides you with a sample template from which to build, and you can refer to our WADL library on GitHub for other examples. See github.com slash apigee. You can upload and test your WADL at any time. One tip I would offer is to begin by describing just two to three resources to get a feel for how the process works. Once you are happy with your progress, then you can continue on to describe the rest of your API's resources and methods. Be sure to notice the iframe code on the Embed tab. Simply place this snippet on any web page and Apigee will do the rest. Lastly, you have the option to change the visual style of your console using the Style tab. This is how the console has been made to match Etsy, SoundCloud, LinkedIn, and PayPal sites. Best of all, when you're finished, your developers will learn how to use your API more quickly, enabling them to build better things faster.